three different sections you were going to go in, into with curiosity, intelligence, relationships, and happiness. And you had a clear uh, body part for each section. And that made it a really good, really clearly uh, able to understand each section. It wasn't like, I'm going to talk about this for one second, and I'm going to talk about this. It was very uh, organized. Another thing I really liked was all the different visuals you gave. Uh, both your body language is pretty good. Uh, you use a lot of different body, body language. I remember when you said something about the second you kind of pointed to, which is kind of good. The other thing uh, is all the different visual imagery we got from the like, crying little girl and uh, the curious George, which was really good because it's kind of a symbol of your whole speech. I really like that too. Uh, certain improvements you can make. Uh, one, I would say, is, of course, eye contact. We're always working on eye contact. I'm working on eye contact whenever I'm up here. Uh, one, one good thing you can try to do is look at someone on the right side, look at someone in the middle, look at someone on the left, and then just try to make eye contact with that person, because even the person from the person you're looking at is going to think, oh, I'm looking at him or her. So that's just one way you can improve, and it's always something that we're all trying to improve on. That's something I sometimes struggle with. Another is uh, try to speak a little bit louder. I could hear you fine. And, but I was also about 10 feet away from you. So if you were in a big hall and someone was 20 rows back, they might have trouble hearing you. So that's just something, you seem like a pretty laid back guy and laid back people, I'm a laid back guy, and laid back people tend to speak a little softer. So it's just something you, you kinda gotta work on a little bit. Uh, I would say maybe practice at home and try to speak like where you're talking to someone that's like 30 feet from you. Just something to kind of work on. But other than that, I thought you are speech was really well done. Uh, everything seemed uh, really, you really organized it well. I could see you prepared for it. And else? And uh, I actually learned some stuff. Um, some curiosity is something I've been really interested in. I like learning new things every day. And this kind of gave me a, another perspective on curiosity and some stuff that I didn't know about. So I really uh, enjoyed the speech and I look forward to hearing your speeches uh, in the future.
And now I'm going to give my evaluation of me. I really felt like it went really well tonight. I felt like the limits didn't change. It was mass communication. There was much to pick up. I really enjoyed the speeches tonight. And I really had fun with the topics. Good, good things to come up on Mark. I like how we had a slide and then we had a session for you on iPad. And so I'm still working on the key for this. So <laughs> and I really feel like this is a great meeting. We're back from break. We're hopefully fresh, refreshed, and recharged and ready to take our, our next few meetings. And now I'm going to call up Stephen, who will do this for the next few Thank you, Thomas, for your general evaluations. At this time, I'll present the award for the best single topic speaker. Drum roll, please. Yeah! Thank you. 